Hi everyone, my name is Parul. Welcome to my channel Parul English Lab. In today's lesson, we will learn about past perfect continuous tense. This tense is also called past perfect progressive tense. So, let's get started. Past perfect continuous tense. Let's look at the structure first. Subject plus had been plus first form of the verb plus ing. Past perfect continuous shows an action that started in past and continued till another time in past. Okay. So here again we can say that we are talking about past in past. One more tense was there where I told you that we talk about past in past that is past perfect. Okay. And then in past perfect continuous again we talk about past in past. How? Let's take a look. I had been working at ABC for five years before I joined this company. So let's understand this on a timeline. Okay. So this is a timeline. This is present right now. Anything after present is future. Anything before present is past. Okay. Now just imagine that I started to work with ABC in 2015. Okay. This action took place. I joined ABC in 2015 okay and I left this company in 2020 okay. So there is a duration of 5 years okay. This action which started in 2015 continued till 2020 which is again a time in past okay. We are not talking about present we are talking about past only but there is a duration okay now in 2020 when this action took place when i left abc i joined this company another action started all right i joined this company so basically an action started in past it continued for a specific time in past only and it continued that is why we call it past perfect continues because the action continued in past all right so i had been working at abc for five years before i joined this company okay so we use past perfect continuous tense in these kind of sentences wherein we have a combination of past perfect continuous tense okay this is past perfect continuous tense okay and this is simple past okay so we use it with simple past so this is the formation of uh, these kind of sentences now look at the structure as well i subject plus had been plus work is the first form of the verb plus ing okay so i had been working had been working is a verb tense okay so that's how we construct a sentence in past perfect continuous please don't get confused between past continuous and past perfect continuous tense the difference is very simple past continuous means that an action was going on in past at a particular time okay so for example if i say uh, yesterday at one o'clock okay yesterday at one o'clock i was watching tv okay so i am talking about this particular moment in past that at one o'clock the action of watching tv was going on okay i was watching a movie at one o'clock all right but when i say that i had been watching tv when my mom called me up okay so that means that there was a duration okay so it shows the duration wherein past continuous doesn't show a duration it only talks about that particular moment in past that an action was going on but whenever you have to talk about a duration you have to use 
past perfect continuous a duration in past all right so that is the basic difference between past perfect continuous and past continuous now if you have to say that you know i had been waiting for my friend for an hour when he finally arrived okay so that time you cannot say i was waiting for my friend for 2 hours when he finally arrived okay that is grammatically incorrect people say that but you please don't say that that is grammatically incorrect so wherever you have a duration in past you will use past perfect continuous do not use past continuous here i want to tell you the difference between past perfect and past perfect continuous also the difference is this that past perfect tense means an action which ended in past before that another action ended in past only okay so past perfect shows the order of actions in past okay for example the plane had left when we reached the airport okay so the action the plane had left happened first and then another action in past took place which is when we reached the airport okay so two actions happened in past all right so there is no duration no action continued in past all right so that's why this is only past perfect but past perfect continuous means an action continued which started in past and it continued till a specific time in past only and from there another action started all right so that is past perfect continuous because an action continued in past it has a duration so that's why past perfect continuous okay there is only one situation wherein we can say that past perfect and past perfect continuous are same this is the situation when we have a duration okay for example i had lived in mumbai for 5 years before i moved to delhi okay so the meaning of this sentence is that in 2005 i started to live in mumbai okay and i was there in mumbai till 2020 so we have 5 years duration is there okay so i lived in mumbai for 5 years okay and in 2020 another action took place which is i moved to delhi i shifted to delhi okay so i had lived in mumbai for 5 years before i moved to delhi so this is past perfect tense okay and this is simple past okay now let's look at the second example i had been living in mumbai for 5 years before i moved to delhi so again means that the action started in 2015 i started to live in mumbai in 2015 i continued living there till 2020 5 years duration and i left mumbai in 2020 and i shifted to delhi so i had been living in mumbai for 5 years before i moved to delhi okay all right so in this situation only this is past perfect continuous tense and again simple past so we combine these two sentences with simple past only okay and here the meaning of these two sentences is same only in this situation i am not saying that past perfect tense and past perfect continuous tense they are same they are not okay they are used differently at different places but only in this situation wherein there is a duration the meaning of both the sentences is same this is completely your choice whether you want to frame a sentence in past perfect tense or past perfect continuous tense so please do not get confused between past perfect tense and past perfect continuous tense here we have some examples let's go through them one by one first is she had been studying for 2 hours before sam arrived okay so when this action happened sam arrived this is in simple past 
and before that another action had been going on for 2 hours so an action started in past it continued for 2 hours in past only and when it ended from there another action took place okay so this is in past perfect continuous tense and the interruption is in simple past we had been waiting for her call since morning when she finally called again this action which has a duration okay which is in past perfect continuous tense this action this is a longer action okay and it started in past continued for some time and then it ended in past only and this action <coughs> was interrupted by another action which is a shorter action when she finally called so the shorter action should be in simple past which happened later in the past and the earlier action in past which has a duration will be in past perfect continuous children had been playing for so long when their mom scolded them <clears throat> again a longer action which took place first in past the action of playing started in past first and it continued for some time okay and then this action was interrupted by another shorter action so this shorter action will be in simple past okay and the longer action is in past perfect continuous tense which has a duration okay jane was tired because she had been running now this is a little different you can see that we have connected these sentences uh, with when or before okay but here we are connecting it with because okay so we can frame the sentence like this also wherein we are showing cause and effect okay something happened in past or a past situation and what caused that situation okay so that is in past perfect continuous tense jane was tired again this is simple past combination is same past perfect continuous plus simple past okay but here this is a fact we are talking about because there is no action here okay so jane was tired this is a situation in past and what caused this situation because she had been running that means that in past this action the action of running continued for some time and this action caused this situation jane was tired because she had been running okay so this is in past perfect continuous tense now sam gained a lot of weight because he had been eating junk food again cause and effect sam gained a lot of weight simple past a situation in past and what caused that situation he had been eating junk food so this is past perfect continuous tense now you can make a negative sentence also here how sam gained a lot of weight because he had not been eating healthy food okay so that's how you can frame a negative sentence he had not been eating junk food okay so not will come after had okay he had not been not he had been not that is incorrect okay she failed the test because she had not been studying okay again a negative sentence she had not been studying past perfect continuous tense and a past situation here there is an action failed so she failed the test okay but why did she fail the test because she had not been studying properly that's why okay so this is in simple past now i was angry a past situation why because this is simple past why because i had been waiting for you since 5 o'clock okay so the action continued in past for some time and this is the reason why i was angry so this is in past perfect continuous tense sometimes we make sentences without a past action also okay for example last night i had been watching a movie from 9 to 11 o'clock so we do not have a past situation or past action 
okay but we have a time which shows that we are talking about past this is some time in past last night what had been happening i had been watching a movie from 9 to 11 o'clock okay so we have a past time and before that an action had been going on for two hours so there is a duration that's why we will make it in past perfect continuous tense okay it had been raining last week so last week again a time in past so last week throughout it had been raining okay now let's change these sentences into interrogative had you been watching a movie had you not been watching a movie okay had it been raining had it not been raining you can make these sentences with uh, contractions also like hadn't you been watching a movie hadn't it been raining okay had you been studying when I called up had you not been studying when I called up hadn't you been studying when I called up okay so that's how you can make positive negative and interrogative sentences in past perfect continuous tense please practice and if you have any doubts Please mention in comment section. Let's go through the contractions. However, I tell about contractions in my each and every video. But still, let's revise once again. I had is I'd. You have to remove H-A. Okay. H-A. You have to remove. So, I'd. You had you'd. They had they'd. We had we'd. She had she'd. He had heed. Okay. Negative. I had not is. I hadn't. You hadn't. They hadn't. We hadn't. She hadn't. He hadn't. Okay. So these are the contractions which we use in informal conversation, not in formal communication. Thank you for watching my videos. If you find them helpful, please like and share with your friends. Feel free to leave comments. Do subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to receive a notification for the new videos. Thank you, take care and have a great day.